So here's the problem. Typical motorcycle helmet sits on the bike. Somebody comes along and says, oh, that's nice. Let me just steal that, okay? And so it's gone. What do you do? Well, that's where you bring in the lid locks. This little device right here is the nicest way to secure your helmet without it being able to be uh, stolen by anybody. So let me show you how it works. Here I have two helmets with two different styles of chin strap locks. There's the traditional D-rings, and then there's the lift type. Lid locks had you covered on either front, so regardless of what style you have, you can use this device. Okay, so here's how you would attach the D-ring style helmet to the lid locks device. Grab your D-ring and just slide it down in between and push this in, and now it's locked. And to remove your helmet, you would take the key that comes with the kit, put it in, turn it, it pops out, and then your helmet is free. If you have a helmet with a clamp style and no D-ring, then included with the kit is this nice little flat T. So all you'll do is pull this down like you normally would, drop this in, and then take your helmet and secure it to the lid lock. It just drops in, push the button in, and it's locked. That's nice, it's secure, highly recommended. To remove the helmet, same thing. Insert the key, give it a turn, the pin pops out. The helmet is free. The lid locks device is installed to the perch clamp through either the lower bolt of the perch or the upper bolt. And let me show you how this device actually operates internally. When you receive your kit, and this is a, a larger heavy duty size, he sells both and you can purchase whichever one you like. The set screw is backed out enough so that you can unscrew this inner piece. So there's the housing. There's the slot. It comes with a quarter 20 thread or whichever bike size you need. You might need metric. Maybe it's SAE like this. The bolt drops through. And then you put a spacer on if you need it. And then you would use a wrench to go in and tighten that bolt up onto your perch clamp. And once that's secure, you would screw this in to where it's flush, all the way down, and then tighten your set screw to lock the cylinder in place. You have your pin that slides through and grabs your D-ring. So that's how it mounts to the motorcycle. It's an ingenious device, I think. Uh, really nice, two different sizes, this large size, and the size that you saw mounted on the bike right now. And that's it. Lidlocks. Check it out. More information in the description.